Yo, hold on, let me. I like this angle right here. You know what I'm saying? I feel like we just chilling together. You know what I'm saying? So look, bro. Oh yeah, I like this. I like this. Hey. What's good, y'all? Um, to everybody that watch my vids, man, and be expecting these bangers, man, I'm sorry. Um, once y'all hear everything that's been going down in my life, bruh, y'all gonna understand exactly why I haven't been able to, to post, bruh. Like, like, 2018 was supposed to be a year for me. Like, I mean, it still is, bruh. I still have hella faith in this year. But right now, bruh, I swear it just seems like all odds are against me, like, like, just the way, every, how everything is happening, bro. Like, you would think I'm finna die or, or somebody finna like capture me or some shit. Like, like what, what, like, could it get any worse? You know what I'm saying? Like, that's how I'm feeling right now. So, um, before I even get into any of that, if anybody has been trying to uh, contact me on any social medias, any of that shit, I don't be um, on social medias like that no more. Uh, I try to stay away from that shit. Um, I'll be on there from time to time. I haven't been responding to any DM. So if I didn't see your DM, I'm probably not going to see it unless you hit me back after you see this video. Uh, so if so, after you see this video and you you hit me up for anything um, on Twitter, IG, any of that shit, you might just hit me up again, bro. Uh, and, and I'll be I'll be in my DMs today, uh, responding to any business, uh, any anything, anything, bro. Just hit me up today, cause I know it's, it's a lot. I seen I had a, I have a lot of DMs, bro. Like, like this past two weeks has just been it's been rough for me, and I just haven't been able to focus on any of my social medias. I can't focus on my my YouTube, none of that. And so far, just in 2018, I have gotten arrested. I have gotten into two car crashes. I've been sick three times, bruh, in 2018. I never get sick, but for some reason this year is like, you know what I'm saying? And I'm sick right now. I'm actually like, I don't know if y'all hear it in my voice, but I'm actually getting over, I don't know what I had, but it's to the point where I haven't even, this is this is my first day like actually being able to get out of my bed type shit. I've been like stuck in my bed, bro. Like, like I haven't been able to do anything. So it's like, you know, um, yeah, I've been sick. Then on top of that, I got jumped yesterday at Zaxby's. That's a whole nother story time. Honestly, I don't know if I'm gonna tell that story time. I got This is basically a story time right here on when I got arrested and shit. But, um, which actually happened last week. Uh, but the whole, bro, it's just so much. Like, like do y'all see what I'm saying? Like, do y'all see, like, do y'all see what I'm talking about? I'm gonna put a clip of, um, I'm gonna put a clip of how my car look and shit. My car is fucked up, man. Uh, for those who follow me on Twitter, bro, y'all already know how my car looked. Y'all already know I was dealing with that. Um, but like, like I said, man, this whole like, bro, I, 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 I finally felt good enough to eat some Zaxby's last night. Um, went to Zaxby's and I, and I got and I got jumped, bro. That's a whole nother story time, bro. Y'all let me know if y'all want that. They caught me lacking, bro. I ain't even gonna lie. Like I wasn't expecting. None of that to happen. I just I was just expecting to go go get some food. You know, Zaxby's is five minutes away from my house, so I didn't take my pea shooter with me. I was I was lacking, bro. I was sick as hell. But young DJ ain't go out like no bitch. You know what I'm saying? I ain't go out like no bitch. But anyways, bro, y'all kind of see what 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 my year has been looking like already, man. Like my year has been rough. It's been real rough. So. Um, I just, I just asked that y'all bear with me, man. I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna get on my shit, but right now I'm dealing with so much bullshit at once. Anyways, bro, I wanna, get, I wanna tell y'all about this whole incident where I got, I got locked up. All right, now, like I said, bro. Oh, and I got a new tattoo, Pete. It's not nothing big or nothing, but you know what I'm saying. So boom, I woke up that morning. I went and got my car fixed. I had to get. My brakes took out and new ones replaced. I had to get an oil change, all this other shit just for my car to pass emissions. All right, now mind y'all, my mom has been telling me for like, <clears throat> my mom been telling me for like two months now to go get my tags. Um, for those of y'all who don't, who don't know what tags is, basically like every year you gotta get like a new tag and you gotta pay like money to get an, uh, a, a new tag. It's bull, it's, it's a whole lot of dumb shit, like a whole lot of grown up shit that I don't got time for. But um, I woke up that morning, uh, 
because that morning I had to go get my landlord from the airport. Uh, so I woke up that morning knowing that I had to do that. So I went and got my car fixed early in the morning. Cost me, bro, cost me so much money. Like, I'm still mad at the fact that I spent all that money and totaled my, like, damn near totaled my car. But, um, shit, I'm just, hey, it is what it is. But, but, I went to go get my car fixed. And the night before that, I was with my homeboy uh, and and a couple of his, or I was with my homeboy and his girl. And uh, we was hotboxing my whip. You know, like, it, it's like, that's some normal shit, like, whatever. But just keep that in mind, all right? So uh, my car was smelling like that that GD. Like, that wasn't GD, bro, that was ED. If y'all don't know what ED is, bro, if you're not from Atlanta, you wouldn't know, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, <clears throat> people think I'd be joking about gorilla dick, nigga. That's, that shit is real, nigga. Elephant dick is too. Pretty much, we were smoking that shit, so of course my car is gonna smell like, you know what I'm saying? And I wasn't even thinking about that. Like, I wasn't even thinking about none of that, bro. So, boom. Um, I get my car fixed and I go back to the house. Um, I go back to the house because the dude at the place had told me like, yo, your car smell like that shit. And I'm just like, damn, well, I know I got like a little bit of the weed left in here. Plus like the roach last night. I don't even know where uh, my boy girl left that shit. Like, I don't know where she left it, but I know it's in here. I know she didn't take it. So, because I bought the weed, you know what I'm saying? So, I know the roach is in here somewhere. I couldn't find it. But luckily, I was able to get, like, the bag of weed and the Rellos and all of that shit out of my car. I came back home to grab a couple of things. Um, and then I was on my way out to the airport to get my uh, my landlord. <clears throat> so, boom. Um, I'm pulling out my neighborhood, and I'm on the phone with my friend. And she's just talking. And I drive past 12, and... And I'm just, and I, I don't know, I just like, I had a, a weird feeling as soon as I passed them. And I just, and, and it's like that anytime I get around 12, like, I just start getting nervous. I don't care if I know I don't got shit, like, I get nervous. I don't know, I don't know, are y'all like that? Like, is that, I don't know, it might just be me. I see the, well, when I get to the stop sign, it's a four-way stop sign, and I bust that left. I see 12 come out of this little spot where they was clocking niggas at. Because you know how 12 just be posted up, just clocking people. So, boom. I'm like, best friend, this nigga is finna, he finna pull me over. Cause he's on my ass. You know what I'm saying? He's on my ass and then boom, his lights come on and I'm just like, fuck, 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 fuck. Like, fuck, you know what I'm saying? So, boom, I pull over or whatever. Uh, he come up and was like, I stopped you for two reasons. One, you didn't have your seatbelt on. I stopped him right there. I'm like, nigga, yes, I did. I had my seatbelt on and mind y'all, he was a white cop. He was a white cop, uh, and he looked like one of those cops that you just, you don't, you gotta watch what you say. You know what I'm saying? But he wasn't, he wasn't, he just looked like it. So, I'm like, first off, sir, I had my seatbelt on, I just took it off. I was like, I swear to God, like, I just took my seatbelt off as soon as you, as soon as you came. Like, I just took it off. And I shouldn't have took my seatbelt off, honestly, but hey, that, that, like, I, I was being dumb, but the fact that he even tried to sit up there and lie about it, like, nigga, you know damn well that's not why you pulled me over, because I had my seatbelt on, and I know that, like, I know I had my seatbelt on, so the whole time I'm on the phone with my friend, and, and he was like, I pulled you over, um, for two reasons, for that, and because your tags are expired, you're registered, whatever the fuck, I don't know, y'all know, bro, I'm, this, I don't know, bro, my, my mom tell me what to do with my tags, and I, and I do it. I don't know what none of that shit mean. Insurance, registration, I don't know. I don't, I don't know what it, I don't know what it mean, bro. I don't, like, all that adult shit is not for me. I'm, I'm, I started explaining to him, like, yeah, I just got my car fixed, so it'll pass emissions. Um, and I was gonna go get my emissions done and get my tags Monday. It was Friday, it was Friday, it was a Friday. Yep, it was a Friday. Um, the, the, all of this went down was on a Friday. So, boom. He was like, okay, I understand, it's cool, blah, 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 let me just get your license. And I gave him the paper, uh, cause they gave me a receipt where I had spent like mad, br bro, I spent so much money on my car. And he was just like, whoa, you know what I'm saying? Like, I could t like he could tell that I was trying to make some type of, uh, you know, uh, I was attempting to, to get my shit together, you know what I'm saying? So, boom, I, I gave him the receipt, 
explained to him exactly what was going on, gave him my license. He goes back to his car, and I'm just on the phone with my friend, blah, blah, blah. He walks back up, and he was like, uh, could you step out of the car? And I'm like, why? Like, why you want me to step out of the car? And I'm like, am I finna get arrested? And he was like, no, but I need to talk to you about uh, something that you could possibly get arrested for. And I'm just like, oh my God, like my heart dropped, like my heart dropped. And I'm just like, what the fuck? Like, so boom, I step out of the car and he told me to leave my phone in there cause he wanted to have like a man to man talk. I'm thinking this nigga finna choke slam me and put me in cuffs and start shooting me in my fucking head. Like I, that's, that was like, that's, that, that was all that was on my mind, bro. I'm just, I'm scared now. I started shaking and shit. So I step out the car. And he was like, look, man, uh, you seem like a nice young man. Uh, I, I don't I don't want um, this situation to get out of hand, like, because you don't seem like, like, I'm, I'm out here looking for bad guys, you know what I'm saying? Not people like you. So, and that's why, that's why I like having my baby face, because I swear, like, niggas think shit, like, I don't mind, I don't mind having this, because, like, I swear, I be getting out of so many situations, so, so many sticky situations with the, with the, with the law. And just period, bro. Just because I look like I'm fucking 12. You know what I'm saying? So, boom. He, he hit me with that and was like, um, but I just want to let you know that your car uh, smells like marijuana. And I'm just like, I knew it. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, well, I let my friend borrow my car. And he brought it back to me last night smelling like that. Uh, blah, blah, blah. He was like, well, I just want to search your car. I'm going to call back up uh, just to watch my back. Um, I don't want to arrest you, this and that, you should be good, let me know if there's anything in your car, blah, 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 and I'm like, as far as I know, there's nothing in my car, sir, you can search it, I gave him uh, permission to search my car, um, and I was just like, because I was just, I was just thinking like, damn, I just took the bag of weed out, and I hope that my homeboy girlfriend ain't leave a fucking roach in the car, because... Like, niggas already know how I get when I smoke. Oh, my God. Can I call you right back? Okay. Calls his backup or whatever. And they get there. And this nigga starts playing Bob the Builder with my fucking car. Taking my shit apart. Getting screwdrivers. Taking my door off on the inside. Just going crazy on my shit, bro. Doing shit that I never thought you could do with a car. Like, this nigga... I'm pretty sure before he went to law school, he was a mechanic or some shit. Like, this nigga knew the ins and outs of my car, bruh. And I'm just like, this nigga dead ass, bruh. Like, this nigga tripping. You know what I'm saying? Like, he was trying he was trying to get me. I ain't even gonna lie. So, he searched my car for about, he searched my car for about 15 minutes. And boom, he comes up to me and I'm like, I found this. It was a roach, bruh. It was a roach and it had weed in it. So he was like, I'm gonna have to take you in, um, blah, blah, blah. And I'm just like, man, what the fuck? Like, what did I, what did I do, bro? Like, what did I do to deserve? Like, nigga, I gotta pick my landlord up from the airport, man. I've been telling her for the past week that I could do this. I had somebody to see later tonight. I'm supposed to be in some cheeks tonight. Like, I got too much to do, bro. Like so boom, they take my car. I'm sitting in the back of the police car for like fucking three hours. They finally take me to like the little place where like you get your fingerprints, your pictures and all that bullshit, the holding cell shit. They search you, all this other bullshit, man. They start searching me, dog, and niggas is wild and they start violating me, bro. Like, bro, it's nothing in my butthole, bro. Like, it's nothing in my butthole, dog. Like, it's nothing in my butthole. Like, bro, like, don't touch my butthole, bro. I probably shouldn't have told y'all that, man. But, um, I'm not hiding shit from y'all, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, you could have just easily patted me down, bruh. And then felt it wasn't nothing on. Like, you ain't had to do all that, bruh. For real. So, boom. I'm only in there for, like, three hours. My mom comes and get me, gets me out. Boom. Turns out what they found wasn't even enough to really even lock me up, for real. So, it was just, like, it wasn't really, like, a big deal, for real, for real. Um, I got to go back to, uh to court they probably just gonna give me fines or community service or like probation they not finna put me back in jail or nothing uh well i hope not i mean like i said it was like a it was like a roach bro it wasn't that much you know what i'm saying so boom 
from that point, we went to go get my whip out the what's the name, bro. They had told my shit. We went to go get my whip. Um, then boom, my day, my day starts back. All right, like I said, I had somebody to see that night. I was gonna go out and do whatever. Boom, I went and saw my friend. Boom. I'm going home from, from my friend's house. Mind y'all, my friend lives like an hour away from my house. So boom. On my way home, I'm sleepy as hell. It's been a long day. And I crashed, bro. I crashed. I crashed my car. <clears throat> but luckily, bro, ain't nothing happened to my car besides like the 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 right the, the headlight. I'm gonna put a clip in there and show y'all real quick. This was the first one, like that was the first crash that I got into. It was nothing but my, my mirror. It was nothing but my mirror that got messed up in that, that little incident right there. I fell asleep and I hit a wall, bruh. But luckily, all that, all that happened was the mirror and I was able to get that fixed the next day. Um, before I went and got my emissions, boom, I got my emissions, my car passed emissions, boom, I got my tag, boom. Everything was Gucci. Went back to see my friend again. Right after I got my tags, because now I'm driving legally, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't gotta worry about 12 pulling me over because my shit suspended, so boom, I go back to see my friend celebrate, you know what I'm saying? Life is good. I spend, I spend the night uh, with my friend. I'm not spending the night, but I'm just like, you know, like we just out, like we was at the mall and shit, and um, just chilling, boom. Coming back home from with my friend, fell asleep, hit an 18-wheeler on a bridge, and then that's how my car got how it is now. Um, I went back the next day on the bridge, like because I had to leave my car on the bridge um, because it like it wouldn't drive, <coughs> so I had to uh, call tow people, and they came and picked me up. And I was looking at the bridge, bro, and honestly, bro. I could have, I could have died. Like the way how, the way how that bridge was set up. Like nigga, I could have hit that 18. All right, my, I don't know what the hell just happened to my camera. I don't even know where I left off at. Like it just stopped recording. But um, like I was saying, bro, I'm just thankful to be alive, man. I'm blessed to be alive, and and for my car to even be fixable because the 18 wheeler had no damage done. You know what I'm saying? It was no damage to the 18 wheeler. Um, my car, y'all seen what it looked like. I could have died that night, man. Uh, and no matter all of these L's that I'm taking, bro, like, I'm just thankful to even still be alive and still, you know, have my subs to, uh, tell these stories to, man, because shit, bro, like, life, life has just been crazy for me lately. And I just, I really hope y'all understand where I'm coming from when I say, like, I'm really going through some shit right now. And, uh, y'all just gonna have to bear with me, man. Still trying to get over my sickness. <clears throat> I would have been having like reactions and challenges for y'all, but I got sick again and it was like, like bro, my luck is just terrible. You know what I'm saying? I feel like this is just a wake up call, man. So uh, yeah, man, that's pretty much what's been going on, man. Hope y'all boys understand. Y'all make sure y'all follow me on all of my social media so y'all can stay up to date with um what's going on in my life, bro. Because I do be updating my or I do be. Um, updating y'all with certain shit on my social media um so yeah man follow everything that's gonna be like down here somewhere um yeah man i love y'all man for real for real uh gang shit and i think that's where i'm gonna end the video off right there you know what i'm saying see y'all boys in the next video gang 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 you know what i'm saying gotta go crazy